What's up everyone? Welcome back to the Durbin Compound. If you haven't met me already, my name is Devin Durbin. So today on the channel, we're going over some mink oil application on some leather boots. I hope to teach you some tips and tricks along the way, so stay tuned. Alright guys, so what you'll need for this project is I always have a microfiber towel, a, uh, of course your mink oil, depends on what kind of uh, brand you get. Um, I've always had the Ariat or the Griffin mink oil, um, they've all been good to me. And I also throw in some leather gloves, so usually I only put a, a, a leather glove, a latex glove. So I usually only put a latex glove on one hand, the hand that I'm applying with just makes it that much easier for cleanup. So I'm gonna bring you in close here. Um, I'm gonna shift the light so that you guys can see this application and just exactly what I do. Okay guys, let's get down to it. So uh, this is pretty straightforward. Um, anytime you apply mink oil, I'm gonna warn you if you're looking into it, um, it will make the leather a lot darker. So just keep that in mind when you're thinking about mink oil on a fresh set of boots, it is going to make the leather a lot darker. So literally you just take your paste here. Uh, if it's warm inside the house, you'll get a uh, nice uh, easy application there on your fingers and we're literally just going to rub it into the leather. So I'm going to make a couple talking points while I'm doing this. Uh, I always uh, concentrate on my seams. Uh, usually most of the time when people uh, talk about boots wearing out it's always along the seams first and what happens is you get moisture, you get dirt and uh, it basically breaks down the threads in between the uh, in between the leather sections. So a lot of people will say, oh, these boots only lasted me a year, blah, 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 blah. Well, they didn't take care of them. They let moisture rot out the uh, threads and then they come apart on them. So that's the first place you're gonna have water intrusion in a leather boot. Uh, your mink oil keeps that leather supple and uh, definitely allows it to uh, keep its uh, you know, water repellent uh, properties. So this mink oil, you can already see how dark it makes the, the leather. Um, I'm a big fan of it. Some people aren't. Um, some people want to keep that light leather look. Now, uh, the mink oil will keep it impervious to a lot of things. So I've, I even had uh, recently this exact pair of boots I was wearing uh, during a paint mixing uh, event where I was mixing a five gallon bucket of epoxy paint, uh, white, and uh, literally the bucket spun around on me and literally covered these boots in white epoxy paint. So you can't even tell that these were even in uh, a paint accident where they were literally covered. Um, I didn't get them to the point where I could clean them off for about 20 minutes. So the fact that, uh, see even, th this is some aluminized paint right here um, that was on there before, but you can't even really tell where I had um, literally covered these things in white paint. Uh, it, it was able to be cleaned off. Um, I used some uh, citrus based cleaner and it literally allowed me to wash it right off of the leather. So that's the awesome thing about mink oil is when you're doing your boots like this um, and you keep up with it often to keep your boots in good shape. Um, keep the leather pliable, um, keep the uh, water and all the crap out of it and it all around just takes care of your boot uh, from the outside in. You know, I, you know, if you've watched any of my previous boot videos, I'm a big proponent of boot drying. Uh, you definitely need to take care of your boots day in and day out. If you want some longevity out of them, you need to dry them. Um, and a boot dryer is the best way to do it. So uh, keeps the stitching and stuff from rotting from the inside. This will definitely protect them from the outside. So these boots are about three years old. Um, they're well worn. Um, I'm about to get them resold. You can see the soles on them. Um, they're just getting worn down. So uh, after you've coated the boot um, uh, completely, uh, the directions on all mink oil I've seen always say wait five minutes. So we're going to set this off to the side. We're going to do the other boot. And then uh, by the time we're done doing the other boot, it'll probably be about five minutes. And all we're going to do is literally um, 
uh, just wipe it off with the microfiber. So. All right, guys, so as I uh, start to wipe this boot off, um, it's been about five minutes. Uh, you don't want to overly work um, the, you don't want to overly work the microfiber. You're literally just wiping off the excess. So just be careful to wipe, you know, around the, uh, around the seams and things like that. Just get the gunk off here. Um, as you wear the boot, the rest of it will come off. Um, not necessarily need to be uh, going crazy with the microfiber, just wipe off the excess. So a couple things that I wanted to uh, put in here also with this video is that I do this every couple weeks, uh, maybe every three weeks or four weeks, whenever I see the leather start to get the color that I started with, uh, you know, that's when I do it. And you see how, it, how um, it turned the leather a nice darker color and it's very, very pliable. So then it makes it very, very comfortable to wear every day. Um, and I attribute the reason why my boots last so long is because I take care of them. So um, don't think that you can just throw a boot on your foot every day and it's going to last an eternity. Um, some of them are good, some of them are bad, but it also depends a lot on you. So we're going to go ahead and clean the other boot off and uh, wrap up this video. All right, guys, I hope that brought some value to you and your boots. Um, applying mink oil is a simple process. Take the time to take care of your boots. Um, they will take care of you. Um, I've worn the crap out of these boots, and every time I use mink oil um, and refresh them, people are like, man, did you get new boots? No, I just take care of the boots that I wear in day in and day out. So um, keep that in mind. Uh, always take care of your stuff it'll take care of you. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Give me a thumbs up or a thumbs down, whatever you're into, and we'll see you guys in the next video.